Hey guys, it's Jess and I am here today with a book review. I haven't done a book review in a while. I don't have a good reason for that. I've been reading a lot, I've been writing a lot, just getting stuff done. Uh, but today, I am going to review The Year of Yes by Shonda Rhimes. I love this book so much. Uh, if you're not familiar, Shonda Rhimes is the writer and director for Grey's Anatomy, Scandal, How to Get Away with Murder, and a Private Practice, those four. So she, as she mentions in the book many times, she pretty much owns Thursday Nights on ABC. Way to go, girl. You rock it. Um, but this book is about her year where she decided to say yes to things, to everything, and what that meant for her. How she grew as a person, how she grew in her personal and professional life with her kids, and it is so good. Oh my gosh. If you're not, I don't care if you're a woman, you're a man, you're young, you're old, you're in the middle of your career, or you're just starting, this book is a must read. Because she talks about like how she decided to bring her life basically up a level and just kind of own it, you know? And it is so, not only inspirational, but so eye-opening, I think. We become very complacent, <laughs> generally, all of us, become extremely complacent with just, you know, going about our days, doing our thing, kind of going to things occasionally, but she said yes to absolutely everything that came to her door, everything that came to her plate, her kids, her professional life, to speaking engagements, everything. And it's awesome. It's awesome to hear about. It's awesome to be inspired to be that. Do I think I'll say yes to everything for a year? Probably not. <laughs> but it does inspire me to try harder to do things, which is something I don't do now. Like I said, oh, I'm going to go skydiving this year, and I never went. I want to get my motorcycle's license. Never did it. You know, we always say these things, but we never do them. And that's what this book focuses on, is doing them. And so I think the beginning is pretty funny. The whole book is not funny. Um, that is important to go into it because I think a lot of times we've been, well not a lot of times, recently we've been given a lot of books by writers and comedians that are funny, that are them being humorous. This one is not necessarily about humor. It's not about her funny bone or about how well she writes a joke. It is about her journey, her year, and how she went about it. And so you can kind of like take that same idea and roll with it. Uh, so, highly recommend, definitely 5 out of 5. I don't care who you are, I think this is a great, great read. Pick it up, do it. Um, if you're on the fence, I've heard the audiobook is just great. I didn't listen to the audiobook, I read it on my e-reader, but I've heard great things either way. If you have read it, let me know down below your thoughts. And that's pretty much it. Short video. I should be back on Wednesday with a books I want to read before the end of the year. I'm super excited about that. Uh, so let me know what you're reading. Let me know if you enjoyed the year of yes. Thank you so, so much for watching. Please like and subscribe, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!